Welcome, we are back, we're in the new apartment This is going to be a YouTube video We are reacting to your guys' setups And we're switching it up a little bit this time What I want to do with this video is I want to get a little bit of background information on your guys' setups Seeing pictures is cool But like the story behind it, a lot of times It, it makes it better And it means more Also, if anybody's wondering how to be featured Type exclamation mark discord in my Twitch chat And then you'll get an invite to my discord You'll go to PC setups And then you can submit there I'm gonna skip every single picture that does doesn't have a story with it because that's not what this video is about so this is where it's starting all these people have no background so we're not going to do them we're going to start here so this is iNeex uh, it took me four to six months to build this setup I used to have a Chromebook as my second screen for stream for just for chatting and I had a PS4 as my main with a 24 inch uh, LG monitor but after working my butt off for hours I was fortunate enough to get a PC 3060 3600 2TB hard drive 500 gigabyte SSD shout out to my government for helping me um, out and supporting me financially with my PC awesome also, I currently have two 27-inch Samsung Odyssey monitors. Samsung Odyssey monitors are expensive. And a regular 23 HP monitor, 23-inch uh, HP monitor. On top of that, I have Logitech speakers. They're just a simple Steel series keyboard. I forgot my mouse, thankfully. And I use my mouse and keyboard for gaming since I'm mainly a controller player. Okay, how do we feel about that? There's a little grass walls, the wood, and then um, three monitor setup. Okay, looks like he streams too as a mic, a webcam. Um, and you only play COD. That's awesome though, bro. Like, I came from a very similar situation from you i mean i used to not i used to stream off my ps4 like i had a ps4 slim that i got one year for christmas and i like that's where i, I played a lot of like 2k car like fortnite and i used to play on a big tv and i'd stream off of that but that that's awesome dog i think the monitor layout's very functional i don't like how like the monitor here it's probably the mount that you're using like it's like behind it i want it to be lined up i'm like ocd but other than that bro good shit all right and then down here he said he had logitech speakers um he didn't put his mouse somebody has a steel series keyboard i don't know what your, the rest of your space looks like but i think the only thing that i if you have the space to do it looks like you have a little bit of space on this side get a bigger desk like that that's probably what one of my first upgrades would be here just so that it would give because the desk is like the canvas like the base you know what i mean like that's where everything starts you could have best monitors the best pc whatever but if you don't have like good solid big desk and you know maybe you want a small desk but me personally like that's what i would do just like for example you have this it looks like probably a light over here or maybe a camera mount here i'd probably get a bigger desk and then get a mount that can clamp to the desk for like a cleaner look but other than that, good shit. I am a 13 year old streamer and this is my setup. My first setup was a MacBook Air that I got for my birthday and I couldn't run any games except for Roblox. Ever since I was 11, I started getting into PCs. I, I decided to do some chores and I was able to have the funds to do so and build my dream setup. Kind of, it's still a progress, but I decided to share it. I have an ASUS 27 inch 165 hertz monitor as my main, LG Ultra Gear 27 inch 144 hertz as my secondary. I have this on an Ekbike and countertop with two Alex drawers. I have a SteelSeries Arctis one as my headset and some Logitech speakers that I got for 25 I have a Razer Viper Ultimate Wireless and a Logitech G Pro as my keyboard. So now I'll get a new mouse pad from Gutsy Aiden. 2060, 16 GB of RAM, 10700F. I like the the little thing here. I wish it was lined up though. Okay, I do like the colors though. The colors are super nice. Like you have the white here and then it contrasts really well with all the peripherals and stuff being black and then the monitor backgrounds look really good the monitors are lined up uh, i do wish this was lined up though better like you could probably if you're yeah your monitors are desk mounted move your setup like six inches to the right i don't know if that's the right amount but i, I like the color scheme you just gotta move your setup a little bit please please that would make it so much better but for 13 this is crazy low key for 13 it's really really good and like dude you have so much time as long as you're still into gaming and stuff like slowly upgrade over time Time and over time you eventually you'll build what you really you know think is your dream setup you know what i mean don't don't rush it so this is this guy's setup he got a macbook for his birthday two years ago unfortunately i couldn't get a pc the day i first watched your first set of video i got hooked and wanted to build stuff just like you I have a 27 inch 170 hertz monitor in the middle and 34 inch 60 hertz on the side they're both mounted out with the 30 dollar mount i have a 30 dollar speaker g305 rk61 okay it's rk61 and a um a, a wave 15 dollar mouse pad i have this on 150 dollar standing table I have earbuds for headphones and the earbuds have a built-in mic, which I know isn't good, but it gets the job done. That's all that matters. I'm saving up for PC to this day. I'm gonna get one and be strive to be a streamer like you. He's using dude, this gives me OG low vibes or just OG TikTok 
tech talk vibes with the backgrounds oh that background is sick but it's a it's a laptop setup uh i i like this mouse pad a lot actually that's nice i don't know what keyboard that is i've had that speaker too dude honestly for for this being a budget setup it looks really nice and i appreciate you for supporting me and, and showing love i can definitely see the inspiration and hopefully get that pc soon homie much love i want to do pc giveaways so like people people like this guy i'm not promising a pc but like i can like partner with companies and do pc giveaways like this would be like ideal person to give it to just like someone that's been supporting for a while uh he went all out with the setup built this with the typical tiktok desk and legs with a beast of a pc 5950x and a 3090 big old monitor dual monitors down here and he has a productivity setup uh, which looks really clean uh and he has alex shore here he has his uh what's it called over here that does kind of concern me like i like the um the fridge but the way that it's like bend i don't know if that's it bending or something or no i think he has oh no no so i think what it is is like there's like a pivot on the on the fridge here that like is higher i'm guessing right Dude, this setup is crazy i like i've been told him this but i like the little um design he has going over here like the little icicle things that's what i think it reminds me of um and then he has the dual monitors here and then the overhead 49 inch um ultra wide up top which i think is a really clean look and he has a camera over here with his angle being this is the background with the big um chat what are these things called again the little crap I'm forgetting. Pegboards. You see, this is the, his background, though, and he has a little cloud wall. So, I mean, overall, there's a lot of cool stuff here. And it extends the pegboard. That's crazy. There's so much that went into this setup. And then he has his, um, what's it called, setup over here. His productivity setup, which I think is super clean. I like these, too. I, I don't think he's always had those there. I just never really realized. I mean, then he has two wall-mounted lights. And, yeah. This ultra wide looks good though. I probably would. I don't know what that is. Maybe that's something to keep the MacBook cool. I don't know if that's the best place to put the MacBook because I feel like right in the middle, especially with it closed. I know you were going for a symmetrical look, but I don't know if that makes the most sense. But, I mean, aside from that, it's beautiful. I used to play on a Nintendo Switch and he worked super hard. Uh, we worked with his dad to save up some money, some Stuff came from Christmas and birthdays, but this is current setup. He plays with the Steel Series Apex Pro TKL, Razer Death Adder Pro. Right now, he is saving up to upgrade his PC, get a new chair, and maybe a third monitor. His PC specs are a 1660 Ti, 32 gigabytes of RAM, and i5-8400. Okay, this is his cable management. Looks looks good overall. And this is the top of his setup. He has a very red, black, and white setup theme going on uh and then the green wall kind of goes crazy i genuinely think it's pretty good especially like you put a lot of effort into like cable management and there's just a lot going on on the desk and i don't know if you have enough space to get a bigger desk but like with the pc2 monitors and all the stuff you have on the desk it's hard to really keep it clean you know what i mean so i feel like if you had a desk that went all the way out here you'd be able to do that better but hey i mean for what you have it's it's very well done so so good shit Decided to build his gaming setup slash streaming setup around the time COVID hits. I was working at the time as a sales manager slash tech for Apple doing 60 hours a week. Your son just turned one at the time and I realized I was spending too much time away from him and my wife constantly at work. But then all of a sudden Apple decided to lay some of us off and unfortunately I was one of the few that lost their job. Unfortunate, but it gave me the kick and needed to finally pursue what I love to do. So now I own my own custom gaming PC company that specializes in custom water cooled builds. Like the two in the picks and now i go every day doing what i love gaming and building cool pc dude that's fire bro that's a w story um can i have a free pc dude that is that's actually sick pc looks dope though all right nice very nice setup i like the little sign you got going on here i wish i could see a little bit more of that it looks like it's your logo you got a very white and black theme i guess i'm less you know of course the setup's super nice but i'm more like focused on this because i don't know i think that's really cool what do we got here 12 700 k 1660 850 watt okay those are his specs if you want to read them i'm not going to read all of them super lights um he went from hp a cheap hp in 2009 that he put a 1660 in to what it is today wow it has been through many variations upgrades and color schemes he ultimately settled on the stack layout after having a t layout side by side he recently just got a new motherboard cpu and psu because you need an upgrade for 3d modeling slash rendering we can get a white th strix 30a or a white 40 series card he also plans on getting a butcher block some speaker stand and a govi glide in a month or two nice setup lucas nice pictures too lucas yeah so i mean i like the natural green and um white uh setup it's very nice pc look it looks good pc looks real good i definitely you know that makes sense upgrade to a white card just because it looks 
looks real good um and then you know he has the panels up there doing that same thing very clean overall aesthetic very well done it's crazy though i mean it goes to show like a lot of people start here and then you know not necessarily easy but it takes time to get to here and it's just proof of that this is demetrio setup setup went from a bunk bed setup to a desk setup uh a bunk bed setup hmm interesting and he finished building the setup like two months ago but this is the newest thing in the desk i'm saying for 3060 maybe mv7 so i can stream uh other monitor pc is kind of new you got that that og low monitor setup um uh, nice though i like you have a very you have a color scheme going on and i appreciate that i wonder if you can get rid of that red that's tough but aside from that you know you got the cable extensions the details the details i mean i would fix up these these cables over here a little bit i'm sure you could um and then all i think all you'd have to really do is just you know what's it called these monitors a little better line them up a little better you could probably take off this third piece up here and then take this down so you don't have that sticking out overall though solid solid job if for those of you guys that i didn't get to react to i apologize i legitimately can't react to everything just make sure to be Make sure to be quicker next time. And I'll post stream schedules in the future so you guys will be able to know in advance. But this won't be the last time. And if you guys have made it to the end of this video, I appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Go follow me on Twitch if you guys don't want to be featured. That is it. Peace.